somebody call a doctor because bad medicine is back. Over there's Diamond Dave Damone. This is the Appleton Oak. That's the answer. I'm Mason Quinn. Folks, we are very excited because we're taking a look at The Flash. Now, this is, of course, a first time watch for me. Uh, look, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm just here to see Michael Keaton and all the cameos. That's what I'm about. <laughs> I can't wait. Well, way to steal my thunder, Quinn. I was about to say I'm ready, willing, able to see the Dark Knight himself, Michael Keaton, and getting some nuts. Yeah, you know, growing up, it's a big Captain America, Hulk, Iron Man guy. The, the the running real fast wasn't necessarily my favorite superhero as a slow person myself. Um, but I sentiment or share the sentiment rather with these guys. Huge fan of the original OG Batman in the theaters, at least. Yeah, so, so that's, that's Adam, Adam West. West. You, you know, did cover I yourself. I did cover myself in the theaters. <laughs> People were like, yeah, oh, I'm the gonna get him. I'm gonna get him. Theaters. <laughs> he did that dramatic pause. Just I'm here for Keaton. All right. Let me talk to you. Yeah, you want to get nuts? Come on. <laughs> let's get nuts. <laughs> Agreed with my fellows here. Here for the OG. I um, wasn't around for my uh, for Adam, Adam West. West. I was going to say Michael West because <laughs> Michael Keaton. I wasn't around for Adam West, but good Lord, was I there for Michael Keaton when I was knee high. I just can't believe it's been since 1992 and we're getting them back. I will stop there because I don't want this video getting pulled. Let's go! Yeah. Now you want to get nuts? Come on. Let's get nuts. Sarah, she's out sick, or at least that's what she says. What can I get you? Usually it's my usual and she usually has it ready because I'm usually late. Well, don't keep me in suspense. <laughs> You know, my sister ran a marathon once, God rest her soul. She's not dead, she's just exhausted. We get it. <laughs> oh my God. Rather annoying that she's not picking up. How many first thoughts exactly did you have before you first thought of me? I'm sorry, is my sandwich red? I learned my lesson on the boat last year. Stuff my sister. Oh, oh my God. Sorry if this sounds weird, but are you actively eating that candy bar? M maybe you could throw it to me in the name of justice. I need you here now, Barry. Hi, Bruce. Yes, I'm... <laughs> I like how they redid the title. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Okay, that's pretty awesome. Oh. That's actually not bad. That's really awesome. <laughs> Have we seen him run over water before like that? Well, yeah, he runs fast enough to run over water. I don't know that I have. Maybe, Maybe not this flash specifically. Oh, okay. Oh, nice. oh, right out of the back. The Cone's idiot kid decided to try to play in the big league, put a crew together and broke into the lab at Gotham General. Stole a highly deadly virus. I intercepted them and they blasted their way out. You can handle the hospital, Barry. Somebody has to save the rest of the world, so I was going to do that, if you don't mind. Sounds about right, Bruce. <laughs> He's got the phone <laughs> thing just in his sleeve. Thanks for saving me from the sinkhole, Flash. Barry, gas and water pipes ruptured in the basement. Right. On it. Oh, oh not good. Well, not good at all. Oh, no. Then I'm essentially the janitor of the Justice League, which sucks, but I've come to accept it. But I can't help but notice that it always seems to be a back mess that I'm cleaning up. Oh, boy. oh no. Ah. <laughs> that oh, thing is nice. attacked out. Side Oops. jets on it. Is he wearing a beret? <laughs> all, all bad guys do, don't they? <laughs> Why wouldn't he be? <laughs> yeah. I will say it's very it's very rare that we get to see Batman during the day, so it's that's, actually kind of nice. That's true. I didn't think about that. <sighs> God, I am just not digging the mask for, <laughs> for Bat Flick on It this. does look weird, right? It's terrible. Like... It's the collapse of the East Wing. Oh, man. Oh, holy shit. Yes. Wow. Oh, no. There's a baby. Oh, 
Okay, how is he going to pull this off? I think he's just going to ping pong it because he can... Oh, come on. Oh, wow. Okay, so now things are getting back to normal speed. Yeah, because he's slowing down. Mm. Oh, he's going to hit Vince. He's going to hit Vince with that. <laughs> <laughs> Microwave. <laughs> Perfectly good. Uh, I guess what else is he supposed to do up there? Oh, acid. Okay. Yeah, good call. There's the burrito. Okay, there we go. So, see, it was protecting All fire. All planned. Was a kid about to grab <laughs> pills? Pills. Let's get them all lined up. Okay, I was going to well, say. Well, look at these. Yeah. Nice and easy. Yep. So obviously, you just let him fall. That's donezo. <laughs> Dogs on him. <it. laughs> oh, Jeez. Guys, we've had anxiety in movies before, but this is right up there. Oh, did you really expect something bad? Well, you didn't know. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the old oh, yeah. driving through the fire scene. Yep. Yeah. Whoa! Oh, or that. Check him out! Interesting. Oh! oh well, that would have hurt. So he's got some new armor on that. Yeah, scene. he does. Oh, come on. They took this from Deadpool. <laughs> <laughs> oh! oh. Grappling hooks. Grappling hooks. All right, the that's where it's at. Batman yeah. always is good for those. We yeah. love. It could wipe out half of Gotham by lunchtime. You're just barely hanging in there. Don't drop me. Please don't. Right. Oh. Hey, there oh, she is. is. Looking good, Flash. Well, uh, thank it's too you. are welcome. My ego's far too big to see. What is wrong with that nose? Did he get hit in the face? He must have. All powerful persona to compensate for my childhood trauma. I too have childhood trauma. The last oh, yeah. truly in the Yeah, you gotta get yeah. it off of them. Yeah. I know sex exists, I've just never experienced it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I'd really love to stay and clean up more mess, but this little superhero needs his breakfast. Goodbye, the ears are short on yeah. it. Bye, Batman. Oh, yeah. Well, the ears the, the, the Dark Knight, yeah, they get lower. Yeah. This was never about her. This is about you. You have to stop living in the past. Now, is that fast enough for you? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, think that, the I think that suit was more for his motorcycle and being on the road and everything. Maybe that's why the nose was ugly as hell on there, but someone in the comments let us know. No one would want to believe that their father killed their mother. What do you mean, believe? My dad shouldn't be in jail. My mom should be alive. It's about what the truth is. Right. No, yes, that's... Oh, my God, that's what I meant. Sorry, I have no official comment at this time. Ooh, that didn't go well. <sighs> yeah, I don't I don't know if she was really asking nicely or yeah, if <laughs> she needed a quote. Or if they're both just a little awkward about it. That could be, too. Probably, probably both. Give your brain a rest and help me make the pasta. Come on. Henry... I need you to do me a favor. I don't need favors. Okay. Very easy. <laughs> uh oh, is he doing the Justice League thing? I do believe he is. Looks like. Oh, this is Tron? <laughs> Oh, oh. Is, he's a blur. Tron? Look at that. So I say that was Clark Kent's nickname in uh, Smallville was Blur. What is happening here? Looks like he's going backwards. Oh, he's going, yeah. Now look at that. That's for you. It's like sands in an hourglass. Yeah. So he's going back. Which would explain his running backwards. But I think this is kind of like him. Because remember the trailer? It was like he said something about breaking the multiverse or something like that. Yeah. So I think this is what 
Look, Iris, I really can't talk about the I'm case at all. I'm not here as a reporter. Can we talk? Come on in. <laughs> <laughs> this time, oh, God. we've all been there. Yeah, if that was a mm. super, I think I've come close. Can I offer you a drink? Sure, I'll take a beer. <laughs> uh oh. Beers, beers, beers. <laughs> was he well, always was... able to do that? I'm... Beats me. He moves Help us out. <laughs> faster in a molecular level. Maybe. <laughs> 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 Maybe let that one suck. <laughs> Did the old. Dad wasn't even at home. My mom sent him to go get a can of tomatoes. I think whoever broke into the house thought it was empty. My mom was in there with the knife in her hand and, and things went bad. Just this absurd chain of events. It's like this footage should have finally supported my dad's alibi. Three wives ruined for a can of tomatoes. What if he just had the can of tomatoes? He never would have had to leave. I think he, I think he just heard you. I think so. Okay, so in the Oh, hey. What was that? <laughs> That's Henry Cavill. I know, but it just looks like cartoons. The, the, the cartoon the way it looks. I don't know if that's on purpose or the Batman well, suit well, testing because on crash test dummies. Do you guys yeah. catch that? Yeah. He's just going up the levels back to where he has to get to. Cuz remember it's Which his it's his memory, so that's probably why it could be more cartoony. Yeah. He's going to put the can of tomatoes in, in, in the, the cart. cart. Yeah. That's all he's got to do. Is it the right ones? Green label. But can it be any? She I said uh, what uh, wants to get before. Yeah. Or it's just well, like, right. I'm just thinking, yeah. would it matter? No, probably like, not. If you got an off brand, yeah. maybe it would, maybe it wouldn't, but. Oh, it worked. Yep. 18th birthday. Whoa. Oh, what is that? Yes. What the oh. hell? <laughs> well, this just got interesting, no? Mm -hmm. Well, that was weird. School was, was, is good. School's been great. I've just been working really hard there on my studies. I know freshman year is about going <laughs> out, meeting people. Oh, God, it's going to be everything's different. Yeah, he's not going to know what to say. You have to be very careful. Himself. Oh, shit. <laughs> it is. So that's how we get the second him. I have to shit. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> now... According to Time Cop, they're not supposed to be able to do this. Okay, so there is a memory catch-up yep. for him a little bit. Oh, the bear yeah. that he held on to. Yeah. Got you. Shit, I'm in so much trouble. What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> drug you, and then you pass out, you wake up, and you forget that anything ever happened. Because you're me. No! <laughs> <laughs> it's okay if I drug me. Yeah. There might not be a future if you don't come with me right now. Come with me yeah. if you want to live. Yeah. He had a, a good selection of movie posters on there on the wall. Pacific Rim. How are we going to get inside? Or what are you doing? Will you stop whining? It's going to feel kind of weird. What's <laughs> in between the molecules? Yep. Oh, my God. <laughs> Interesting. I honestly didn't know he could do that. Yeah, I didn't either. Figure if he can move fast enough. Yeah, yeah. I guess. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> 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 oh, look at that. Barry, you're gonna get hit again? It's gonna hit both of them. Well, he yeah. is. He is touching them. Oh, he was touching them. Okay, it goes through them. <laughs> Oh, what's this teeth? Lost a tooth. Ah. Oh. And yep. there you go. There All right. Check. He's safe. Well, well, he's, he gets did anything? To go back. Yeah. Did anything happen to Barry though after getting hit again? It's like you lost a tooth. Oh. Huh? You lost a tooth. Super glue. Oh. oh, that's oh. not how that works. Oh, you got a face. 
<laughs> uh oh. That's what I was worried about. Wait, are his powers gone? That's what I'm thinking because yeah. he got hit again. <laughs> oh, speed balls. I, I know this is incredibly exciting. I went through it. Speedy Gonzalez. Yes, can't just start. We are young. <laughs> It's weird how we're getting an origin story without really getting, getting an, an origin, origin story. story. <laughs> oh. Hey, yeah. oh, that's what I mean. Like, I think he's gonna have to train him. Yeah, thought maybe he was almost gonna pull an A train. <laughs> oh. Fireworks. <laughs> Oh. There goes the whole grid. Oh. <laughs> Takes a long time to train your body to be able to speed up whilst your molecules slow down enough to pass through the molecular structure oh. of solid oh. oxygen. <laughs> <laughs> right here in front of you? There's no one even here anyway, Barry. Oh, it hurts. You know where it hurts? I'm like, okay. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Eric Stoltz ah, is ah, your boy in that movie. What an embodied ah, yeah, performance. Stoltz. You mean Michael J. Fox? He was never in it. Uh, Stoltz was originally yeah, cast. Yeah. They shot it for six weeks. Yep, and they're starting to... This is obviously a different past. This thing, Zod's world engine, it's started destroying Metropolis. I started trying to save people. There's this kid. Uh, I, I got him, but then I, I couldn't get his dad. Wow. Oh. That's pretty cool that they're bringing us back to this. Yeah. In Back to the Future, Marty McFly is very famously played by Michael J. Fox. The guy from Footloose? No. Ah. <laughs> Kevin Bacon's Maverick with the volleyball, the gay guy. Ah. Oh. 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 Top Gun. Oh. Oh. Kevin Bacon is Maverick. <laughs> that man exists. Hundo P. Yeah, dude, nobody knows who he really is. My cousin Barry Here and, we and go. I have to go to that cousin's dinner. Barry! <laughs> <laughs> We're getting cake. Oh, come Here we on. go. Finally. Come on. Only an hour in. We yeah, finally get them. That's all it took. Well, we had to have the build up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The build up, yeah. It's open. <laughs> oh, it's oh. like it's like we never left. Uh, where's Vicky Vale? I'm, she's got a Joker face. Joker <laughs> on. Hey, I didn't know you painted. Let's... They're good. Oh my god, is he even Bruce Wayne? Well yeah, we know he's Batman from the trailers, never mind, but But still, is there something else? Yeah. Here, I think you're looking way too much into it. <laughs> well, other people don't exist. Maybe he just exists as the rich Bruce Wayne nice. and never became Batman. Well, they already acknowledge that I know be in the trailer, right? Well, I know. Maybe they get to no, it. No, differently. no, they just said in the house. Yeah, oh, nobody yeah, knows yeah, who yeah, he is. Yeah. Batman, right. You don't have like Downton Abbey in your <laughs> <laughs> Downtown Abbey or Banana Bees? No, Banana bees, not right applebees. Happy sizzling zoo square. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> ah. <laughs> it's all just a crapshoot. What does the parmesan mean? The metaphor's over. It's just a garnish. That's a person would have to be an idiot to play craps with a space time continuum. Yeah! <laughs> they said it! Space time continuum! We got our Back to the Future <laughs> reference. <laughs> Bruce Wayne is Batman? Not really, not so much anymore. The world needs Superman. You're the best detective in the world. You're probably the only person who can help me find him. So will you help us? Pass. <laughs> <laughs> Pass. <laughs> hey, remember when you phased through the floor? So I need you to do that again. Oh, we're going to see it. <laughs> oh, here we we're go. Gonna see yeah, we'll we be go. on the Lazy Susan. Uh, oh, is it going to be all the old stuff from the first one? <laughs> yes! There's the car! <laughs> the best Batmobile in yes! my opinion. Yes, it was the best. Yes! Oh, there's the, oh, the symbol. old symbol. They kept it. Yep. Nice. Oh, yeah. she's a beautiful. Oh, she's she is good. a beautiful. Yes. 
unidentified objects entering Earth's atmosphere anywhere near Kansas in the last 50 years. This bag laughs. Oh, it's the yes! Joker! <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh. Can't believe I forgot my Batman shirt. <laughs> Shame on me. <laughs> oh, the music. Oh, the suits. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. Oh. Look at the new ones. Yeah. Oh, it's the music. Look at there's the homage. There's the one that's blue and gray. Yep. Sparks being held by a mercenary group Siberia. in a Siberian black site. The goat's on fire. We're going to Russia. Oh, wait. How are you going to get to Russia? <laughs> <laughs> well, funny yes, you mentioned that. Here we go. It's going to fly up to the moon. Yeah. We're coming back down. Come back down. Well, that's a requirement. <laughs> this has got to be. Oh, the music. I know. Too. That's what I'm saying. It's like a, it is like a time machine for us. You're, you are here. I'm Batman. Yeah! Oh, there it is. <laughs> yes! Yes! I don't care if we saw that in the trailer. Uh, it's still, still it, it oh, different. awesome. Hit different. Ooh, slight modification, yeah. it looks like, a little bit. It's like riding a bike for me. Remember something? He's going to go up to the moon. Do it. It's getting there. <laughs> All right, we're just waiting. Grappling hooks. Grappling hooks. He's his, holding him by the belt. <laughs> he's getting his leg up around him. <laughs> Everybody's fast now. Why is it so cold? It's the Arctic, Barry. Just follow the footprints. The Arctic. I thought they said they were going to Russia. That's a good point. Be down there for sure. Russia can be cold, Dan. Yes. <laughs> yeah, but I think the Arctic generally refers to either. Well, you know, it's mine. There's a North Arctic. <laughs> I go. You catch it. Why, why would you? <laughs> why would you catch that? Wow, they didn't even ask yeah, questions. It was just, just do it. Uh. Oh. <laughs> oh, God, he is He's working him. Still got it. <laughs> Let's go. Now oh, he did a little bail uh. there. Love it. <laughs> That's where you keep Superman. The big scrotum. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna hack the Soviet security cyber scrotum with a flip phone? I tried all the combinations. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Oh, oh my god. Just a kid, isn't he? Yeah. Shit. Come out? Oh, it's her. No, it's Kara. Yep. Oh. I'll handle this jabroni. <laughs> Jack jabroni. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> Oh, right through his knee. Come on, guys. Let's go. You didn't tell me we could get shot. Why would you assume we couldn't? <laughs> Why would you assume so we couldn't? <laughs> oh, man, I need this knee. Stay calm. It'll heal. Come on. How much do you weigh? 180 each plus her 440. Yeah. <laughs> yes. From Vicky. Yeah. How much do you weigh? I don't know. About 103 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. Was that her that? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. See you. Yep. Hi. That was pretty subtle if you weren't paying attention. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that hey. was cool. <laughs> He's taking a light on him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh shit. I, that was going for his face. Yeah, it was. 
What if they shot you in the face, face Harry? <laughs> we were trying to find Kal-El, but we, we found you in, instead. What do you want with Kal-El? Try and, try and rescue him. Why? Because... Show the, show the TV. And... Uh, well, you need to recover your strength. Actually, Barry, take her to the roof and, and put her in the sun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Like, if I mean, but you're solar powered. Good for you. I've been trying to... <laughs> oh, um... Yeah, the suit absorbs it. Yeah. Are you uh good? Do you feel um you feel strong yet or <laughs> sloogy? A lot of humans are there's there's babies and ballerinas and, and entertainment wrestlers. A lot of humans are worth saving. Sports entertainers. <laughs> entertainment wrestlers, I wonder if that was a dig at Black Adam or The Rock. I spent a lifetime trying to right throngs of the past. You actually did it. So, I guess the plan is to douse yourself in death. Oh, is he there listening? Oh, he did. Yep. You heard it. Now the question is, is, does it motivate him to help more now? Yep. Or does he back off because he doesn't want his mom Mm -hmm. Your failure to deliver the Kryptonian traitor is being taken as an act of war. No. Bat <laughs> Bat kite? <laughs> <laughs> it was a kite, but it looked like a satellite. Too, yeah. right? <laughs> they're doing the old Benjamin Franklin, aren't yeah. they? Yeah, that's what they're going for. Heat and impact resistant. Should protect you a little. Right, but the point is for me to not be protected. You're gonna need to be out of the way. Ooh, the black Look. suit. Let's get electrocuted. Let's get electrocuted. This is going to work, right? Of course it's gonna work. At this time we have Batman. What could go wrong? Uh, for the record, I think this is insane. <laughs> 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 is it gonna have the right mix of chemicals? Here it comes. Yep, there's all the chemicals. That's going into them. She can do it. Mm -hmm. Got to get that 1.21 gigawatts. That's what they need. <laughs> <laughs> she just going to fly them up into the clouds? I'm thinking so. Yeah. Doesn't he need the chemicals, though? We're still no, on them. No, they're, oh, they're, yeah. Yeah. they're in them, all right. Boom. Oh. Hey, Barry, you okay? It's like last time, right? So you gotta heal now. He got Ooh, toasted. Big time. Oh, he's gonna modify it a little bit. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I thought that was the Red Hood Batman for a minute there. <laughs> that sound. <laughs> that is. Why did you help me? Because you needed help. Do you know what this symbol stands for? Supergirl means hope, right? Hope. Yes. <laughs> Supergirl. Crypto is a beautiful place. Oh. Logical answer. Yes. <clears throat> you in? Is he going to say it? You want to get nuts? Yes! Let's get nuts. Ah, yes! Let's get nuts! <laughs> yes! Uh, yeah! I mean, I like it when he's a little crazier uh, when he says it, but <laughs> come on. Maybe he'll say it again. Come on! Who needs a candlestick? <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> we were inverted. <laughs> I'd be like, hey, <laughs> hey, bats, how do you be able to... <laughs> oh, oh look cool. at that. Yeah. Sod. Oh, there, there goes gone. that. For Sod. I like it. Oh, what, the Whoa, what is that? that? What did you do? The infant did not survive. No Henry Cavill, Dave. 
She oh, is pissed. Big time. She's going to work over Zod. Just think that chest rug is gone, Dave. Yeah. Well, you can only well, get rid of it with a kryptonite well, gave razor. A, Flash has got a decent chest rug. I mean, it's no Henry Cavill <laughs> chest rug, but I mean, it's, it's there. I love how they play the Batman music anytime he does it. Hey! Ho, 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 ho. Look at that. Drop kick. There we go. Yep. What if I just F for this guy? <laughs> oh, just Emperor this guy. <laughs> nice little Star Wars reference there. Mm hmm. <laughs> Helicopter. Airplane. Airplane. <laughs> <laughs> so similar. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. oh, he's putting up the diamond cutter. <laughs> <laughs> Self high five. It's me. D D D. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, Look at that dent. She, she is a gangster. Oh, she is pissed. I feel like Zod's going to get worked by her. Yeah, but like it, Zod. It hasn't even been close yet. Zod can hold his own, though. Yeah, but. Zod. Uh, she has oh! To, oh! She has to. Oh. Yeah, she's, she wears she, down quick, though. She's got to know about the old uh, neck snappy snappy. Whoa, oh, what was that? Yes. Kind of cool. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> just punching everybody in the face. <laughs> Shut it all down. Oh! Whoa. I can't believe that went through her. Well, he's Kryptonian. Yeah, yeah so. I guess. He's got the blood sample. Oh! Uh. What? I think we just lost. Car is dead. They're both dead. But they don't have to be, right? Because we can go back like you did. You're not fast enough yet. You sure? Uh, Barry! Barry, wait! Go back. Uh, we, no way are you no, taking no. Keats away. <laughs> it's okay. We can fix this. You know what you're going to change? I, I know what I'm going to change. Okay, there's that scene. I'm going after the big one. Bruce, call off that gunship is shield protected. Roger that. But he's not. Who? Space giant? Yes, yes, please take him out. Are <laughs> 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 oh, we about to get dizzy up in here? Oh. Oh! Boom! High five. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's oh. working him. He's oh, taking he the hits, also, though. Oh. He can also slow down, too. Yeah, he was a badass in Man of Steel. Yeah, they messed up the whole city. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and she was, like, practically unstoppable, too. Yeah. Oh. Got her again. Oh. All right, so are they gonna go? Yeah, back again. Oh, just wow. like in two, <laughs> just like in Batman Returns. <laughs> you already did. Yep, that's. They're gonna have to go back in time again. Got to get up. Come on, Harry. Go again. <laughs> but didn't the dialogue just say? Didn't Barry just say we can't go back? Huh? Um, why, is he? why is he taking off the gloves? You better get his Keats back again and quit doing oh. this tease. Took off his gloves to yeah. get rid of Shatter the energy him. dissipation. Oh! oh. Okay, I'm oh. Out. Back. Oh, no. out. Hey, I'm not okay. Oh, okay. I just need to stop. <laughs> Oh, oh, that thing wow. worked out pretty well, huh? Yeah. He's going to come back. And... 
He was late. And, yep. Oh, it's not going to work. It's kind of like the Doctor Strange thing. There's like, it's like a, a million a combinations million, where it doesn't works. work. Yeah. We got to find the one. I am the Flash. And I can save everyone. Nobody dies. Not every problem has a solution. Sometimes we just have to let go. She'll always be a alive somewhere in time. Just give me one more time. Barry! No! Oh, that's him. That's what he becomes after he keeps no. trying. It's got to be, right? Yep. I think you're right. Oh, that's wild. That's who he becomes. What are we ripping apart? That is. Yeah, it's him. totally him. Mm -hmm. yeah. he? Kind of eliminating yourself? Yeah. You are. Yes, I am. Holy yeah. shit. Yeah, look how old he is. I've got it almost figured out. How long have you been doing this? It's inconsequential. Come on, Barry. Was all that stuff like collecting on him yeah. all the times he's taking hot laps? Whoa. Got the disco ball. Oh my. Oh, oh my <laughs> God. That was pretty awesome. Is that the first one? Yeah, they're showing, all the, the first, they're showing all the original guys. That was the first Flash, yeah. yeah. from the different uh, multiverses. Oh, no. Come on. No way. Holy oh, shit. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Unreal. <laughs> Wasn't she on the TV show for a while? Oh, I got goosebumps. Oh, yeah. Seeing, seeing Christopher Reeve. Oh, you know what this one is? Was that Nick Cage? That, that, that was Nick that Cage. Is the Kevin Smith version that never got made. Holy shit. Yeah. I was going to say that looked like <laughs> Cage for a second. Holy it is. shit. <laughs> There's your chest rug. Yeah. Wow. Oh, he's looking good, too. Look at what's happening. These worlds. Oh, oh, God, that was that. so awesome. That's great. You're the inevitable intersection. And you do have to let go. What's he talking about? This is getting wild. Oh! oh. Hey, hey, don't worry. It's going to heal. It's going to heal. Sure about that? Right. Yep. Oh, he's, so he's gone. gone. Yeah. are starting yep. up. <laughs> <laughs> come on that is yeah, awesome that was <laughs> could we get a christian bale batman by any chance i think they're doing a homage to like the all the old school stuff and then yeah. one that was obviously never made yeah script is out there apparently and then test footage hmm. after he puts That's it in tomatoes. when he did it the first time that version of Barry wasn't there, right? We didn't like miss right. it or they use a weird yeah. camera angle. He's going back now. Yeah, yeah. Love you, Mom. What if he couldn't save his mom, but he could save his dad? Yeah, if he just takes the hat off or Yep, see oh yeah, yep. he's gonna think about it now. Yep. That's what I Turn thought. The like, camera he can't down. save your mom, but if he saved his dad and said, Hey, bumped his hat, took his hat off, yep. something, then they'd be on there there'd be video footage, right? Yep, because that's what he needed. Court! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Allen has argued, and his son, Barry, has corroborated since day one. Here. See? He moved them all in the top shelf. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Must have been what it was. Ching for a can of tomatoes on the top shelf. There you go. He moved them all. Okay, that was. I had the right idea, just yeah. not the right, yeah. uh, the yeah. right delivery. You were on yeah. the path. You were on the right path. You were one of the parallel spaghettis. Take mm -hmm. all the cans of tomatoes, <laughs> put them on the top shelf, so he Genius. has to reach up. Hey, speaking of food, I was thinking, um, you should ask me to dinner. <laughs> dinner with me? Yes, a date, Barry. Iris West, do you want to dinner date me? <laughs> you dinner date me? <laughs> 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 okay, and it I didn't sound listen. like Affleck. And things uh -uh. did get very, very weird. At all. I put everything it's going to be bail. 
No, that sounds like not, Keaton. That sounds, that like, sounds Keaton. like Keats. Is it gonna be? Holy oh, oh, shit! <laughs> 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 Who's this? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, come on! What? What? <laughs> <laughs> so what else is going to be different? Oh, wow! We got wow, Clooney! Wow. What? I'm sure there's post credits and all that good stuff. All right, so we got the dog falling. <laughs> okay. okay, so folks, we are... I'll give us a little time here. <laughs> trying to get the burrito. <laughs> the dog trying to get the burrito. I probably should have kept it so we could finish the dog. The plush. I probably should have let the dog finish yeah, it. Have the fun with the dog. Right as the dog gets hit with the plush duck. <laughs> God, one of these times we got to go to an IMAX. And the closest one is an hour and 40 minutes. I don't care. I know. I'm saying we should. I agree. I think we should. We, I've never we experienced it. Is it down in Milwaukee then? Or? Milwaukee, yeah, uh, it's on Wauwatosa. Uh, I wonder what's playing right now. Probably Oppenheimer. Oh, we have all the time in the world. He's my metabolism, right? I can't. <laughs> oh, <that's laughs> so listen, listen. I'm, I'm playing it. No, 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 no. He came from off the set of Fast Ten too. I'm doing my best. Look, you're missing the larger premise here. <laughs> up, up, Rose Iden. Nah. Right, come, come on. Sorry. I thought you were gonna sleep on the couch. I, uh, Arthur, I live right here. Harry, I live right here. Joking. <laughs> <laughs> Arthur, this is Atlantean treasure. You, you told him that. <laughs> no money for the sailor suit. Yeah, I'm a sailor. He's fine. <laughs> Look, that, he that said a, he's fine to somebody. Oh. Interesting. Uh, wow, that was it. Well, okay. well, it looked like he looked at somebody when he said he's fine. It was it, just kind of like probably some bystander off to the yeah, side. Yeah, of I think he was just saying it to say some it. innocent bystander. Wow. Oh, what a okay. What a treat that was. That was the Flash. You know, I came in only wanting to see Michael Keaton, and then you know what kind of cameos or mm -hmm. crazy stuff we're well, gonna do you, you because really we saw one. from the trailer we're gonna play with the multiverse, and you know normally I'm not the hugest fan of the multiverse stuff. I guess you know aside from the cool cameos and stuff you get to me, it always kind of feels like a bit of a cheat code. Like you can pretty much just go and do whatever you want or redo it. So it kind of takes away uh, for me in you know, the comic book style movies and there's a multiverse, it's like, it seems like there's always a way out. There's always a, a way to go back and change it. And it's just kind of like a cheat code. And it takes away the threat of like losing certain characters that we had. Now, mm. when they did it in Endgame, that was kind of the first time a lot of us had been introduced to something like that. But, uh, you know, we had a few other movies that kind of played with the multiverse a little bit. And, you know, like I said, normally I'm not a huge fan of it, but I really liked the way this was done for the one point that when they were at the intersection, it didn't matter how many times they did it. The result was going to be the same every time. And I liked how Barry just kind of had to go back and not necessarily accept his fate, but accept what he could change and what he couldn't change. And what he could change was putting the pasta, the, the rather the tomato sauce on the top shelf. That's something he was able to change. So... I, I liked how they did that. Uh, this was a lot of fun from, you know, from start to finish. Uh, I'm very surprised, honestly. I'm very surprised how much I liked this one and how much I enjoyed it because as, uh, as much as I was able to stay away from the spoilers, like with Clooney coming back, I can't believe that didn't leak out and that we didn't hear. At least I didn't hear about it. Hand on heard about heart, it. guys. I did not know Haven't Clooney was coming. Heard. And Why do you think I spun around? <laughs> I <laughs> well, and I think it. I think would help because I don't know how well this movie did in theaters. I don't have the numbers or anything like that in front of me, but I think when a movie's wow. in the theater and then it's out, mm, yeah. uh, it really affects like how many spoilers get out mm -hmm. and who's expecting to see what or you know all the all the fun stuff gets leaked, but. This was awesome. We got to see Michael Keaton as Batman. They had the music. They had all those wonderful toys that he oh, has. We, we got to look at that, Dave. If uh, Danny Elfman was in there, yeah, and we even had the little bit of a, a nod to the Joker in there. Uh, you know, when they were going back doing the Flash, the flashbacks—not flashbacks, but you guys know what I'm saying—they're showing all the worlds kind of colliding, and we saw all the different versions of Superman and even the Flash. I was wondering how many they were going to give us. And, man, to see Christopher Reeve as Superman again, like, 
it just made me feel like a kid again. And it was, you know, you try not to get too sentimental about, you know, movies and whatnot, but they just, man, they have an effect on you. And it's like, it just, it brings you back to that point in time when you were watching that. And, you know, funny enough how time is a major theme in this movie, but uh, this was a lot of fun from top to bottom. I really enjoyed it. Well, 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 <laughs> no, I, I did really enjoy this as well. Um, I like the fact that they said when you change, when you go to the past and change it, it doesn't just change the future of that timeline. It also changed the past where we got the Eric Stoltz as Marty McFly, yeah, that was you interesting. know, and then the Kevin Bacon and Top, Top Gun and everything is Maverick. So I really thought that was an interesting twist on, you know, time travel. Yeah. But I love the fact that he could go to certain spots and he could see what and where would happen um i love the fact that yes all the cameos they had it's great to see christopher reeve the old black and white superman the ill-fated never made <laughs> kevin smith written and directed superman with nicholas cage who wanted the long hair and the look he wanted to be more nerdy there's like a whole documentary they have they have actual footage of, of a test footage of him as Superman. Yeah. And they did say, yes, they, he wanted to fight a giant spider. Yeah. So that was that was amazing oh, that they, they brought that into the fold. I thought Ezra Smith did a great job as being two completely different berries. You know, one that obviously had a traumatic childhood to one that had everything he wanted. And you could tell because he was... He wasn't as well put together as you can mm. see as a young adult, yeah. but it was still, it was a lot of fun to watch and watch him grow and to help himself become the Flash essentially again. Like you said, an origin story that wasn't quite an origin story. Yep. So I, and I love the fact that they did have him hear about mom. And so that's what drove him to keep going back and back. And then we figured out, like, I wasn't sure if it was a reverse Flash that there is or a bizarro Flash, but no, mm. here it was he himself in that timeline that kept trying to go back and save everything yep. so it made it really enjoyable for me i really had a great time with this yeah this was really unexpected you know i i was i was really happy not to get a lot of spoilers online and it seems really with social media over i want to say the past the last two or three years or so um that people are, have done a really good job about not putting out spoilers in general and i had i had no idea <laughs> Clooney came back no idea we were going to get the flashbacks mm -hmm. certainly not nicholas cage and and so shout out first and foremost to everybody for not putting out spoilers yeah. especially considering that this has been this has been out for a minute i think when people see it in theaters um that initial kind of right. desire to discuss it um, they're mindful. They don't do it, and then you know, after a couple of weeks, they don't discuss. Yeah, it there's anymore. another movie so, already. Yep. Yeah, so yeah. it's it's uh, a, a different landscape than it used to be as far as spoilers on social media. So that's really cool. It creates a, a definitely a, a sense of surprise when you have you know a movie that has big cameos and plot twists yeah. and things like that, like this one did. I gotta be honest, guys. Like, I really enjoyed this movie. Yeah. I thought it was good. And now, we, I've always said I'm a casual comic book fan, so I don't know the backstories. I don't know if this was, you know, some sort of adaptation from the comics. If it veered too far off the comics, honestly, I don't know why people dogged on this I don't so much. Either. I mean, this was a, this was a lot of fun for me. I thought it was an interesting plot. Um, no, just let, let me finish. Um, I agree with Mason Quinn in that sometimes I feel like the multiverse is like, oh, but this is what happens in an alternate universe. And but I think it was done well here. You know, the the fact that they brought in a completely different component that the past can be changed. How we use the spaghetti sticks yeah. to like kind of explain it to you know us, you know, simple folk. Uh, that was cool. Um, you know, it was interesting that. Um, that they kept like trying to fix it and fix it and fix it and you got this guy who's been doing it forever that was really unique is that a strange uh, didn't, see, yeah. didn't see that <laughs> yeah. coming um you know affleck said in the beginning like if you go back who knows what could change and you know near the end of the movie it's like oh they, they got the security footage the dad is fine and the dad's you know but what else changed you changed yep. batman like who knows like whether your interaction in the grocery store or something else happened yeah i mean 
mean, uh, whatever we do, it uh, it impacts things far beyond you know what we can grasp, which I think was kind of what they were trying to show here. Um, look, the, the 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 anything with Michael Keaton in this movie was oh, so nostalgic. Oh, it was so much fun. The I'm Batman. Uh, it was cool. It was cool that the yeah, let's get nuts. It was cool that they showed him kind of in a different light like and then he's like oh gotham city is one of the safest cities in the yeah, world yeah, yeah. Like, fixed it. Like, like, oh really that's that's an interesting twist on the future they didn't he didn't retire because of whatever he retired because they just didn't need him anymore Turned into Lebowski. um but yep. so that that was cool um i i really i, don't, I really enjoyed this movie yeah. and and i know like um you know, I know it's it's not uncommon for critics to say one thing, but the fans to have a different reception. But I think even the fans kind of in general didn't love this one that much. And I just I, honestly, I don't get it. I thought this was a lot of fun. Now, of course, I might be a little, you know, a little over enthusiastic because of the nostalgia. Of Keaton be. saw the Nicolas um, Cage chest looks, rug. It, look, honestly, seeing Christopher Reeve on screen, yeah. it's almost like a little bit of a gut punch. Right, but at the same time, you're like, oh, that's so cool that they did that. Um, and I thought that was Cavill at first with the hairline. It kind of looked like oh. him, and I think they teased us on purpose because it didn't, like, when you see the shadow, that's not the Reeve shadow. That's the Cavill shadow. So I think they teased that mm. for, like, this half-second tease. Yeah, they just had um, one spot with Henry from uh, the Justice League or whatever where he was doing the punch. Yeah, if you go back and you look at that shadow, that's Cavill's shadow. I will fight <laughs> over that but i don't know man i thought this was great diamond dave was laughing at me a little during my review so i have a feeling he's gonna have a different take so no i, I don't have a different take i'm gonna let the uh i'm gonna let all you explain to dave why you may have not liked it i have a pretty good feeling of most of your answers no, no, just, no, no i'm gonna dave you should go read the comments please well, just but, for the sake of this review, we've I got a little shit. bit more time. <laughs> just educate me a little. Nope. Bit. It's on Wikipedia. Dave, let, them, yeah, let me see the let critical them, reviews. Let the folks just feel free to give your oh, two cents. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Maybe it might click yeah, at okay, the end of this forum. But yeah, either way, uh, it, you no, should I, tell I, them. I, 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 look, I got it. And I, and I not to ignore the elephant in the room. I Look, we get it. We all get it. Yeah. We all get it. We came here to watch a movie. And... And the real world is the real world. We pulled ourselves away from that to watch a movie, and and that's that. We're, we're reactors who react to what's on the screen. I get what you're. I get where you're going. We understand. <laughs> trust me. So that being said, that being said, great stuff by the guys. So I will start off. I was entertained. It was a, this actually had a lot of potential. It's just unfortunate with every circumstance under the sun yeah. <laughs> that you could think of for DC. Yeah. I'll just kind of put it as DC instead of yeah. just pinpointing a lot of things. Right. The uh, the unfortunate shit show that is DC. <laughs> uh, good Lord. Uh, James Gunn, you have your work cut out for you. God bless Michael Keaton for saying yes and dusting off the boots to come back. That was so incredibly awesome since it's been 1992 when Batman Returns came to the screens Good oh. lord, it was great to see that. Yeah, we saw the trailer with him saying all that stuff. Mm -hmm. We did the reaction to it, but it did not change our reaction yeah. to this no. because it was great to actually see the movie Still leading hits. up to that point. Because then you're in the moment. It was awesome. Uh, there was some, For the film itself, there were some heartfelt moments in there, mm -hmm. but there was also some goofiness because of the, the CGI in certain yeah. spots. Yeah. Yeah. I felt like with a movie like this and how much they invested into you know slap you with nostalgia and all this nick cage reeves well nick Clooney. cage looked like a playstation 4 character <laughs> I know, I, that had to be intentional yeah, but see, right? i think that's part of it because you remember when he he went into i'll just call it the multiverse everything was like bending and stretching and twitching and i don't think it was supposed to look realistic i think it was supposed Christopher to look Reeve was absolutely perfect yeah no i don't so mean that i mean one. Yeah, I but mean then like, nicholas cage was right. the other one though looking into it and his was right but i mean like the character. babies the the henry cavill stuff when he was in like the, the big, babies the big yeah, the bowl dog. or whatever that's what yeah cause remember i don't know I if it, it was made supposed the cut. to be like that yeah it, patreon seen it but i don't know if it made the cut where you and i were like did you see his eye it, it, it the eye looked a little goofy on uh <laughs> The Flash there for a minute. Yeah. I can't remember. It was uh, oh, down in the Batcave. 
Yeah, I think it was in no, the back cave. No, it wasn't or the back cave. It was when they were doing the first. Uh, okay. Poor, what was the jumper? What okay. did they call it? Yeah. Anyway, uh, phase phasing. phasing. Yeah, yeah phasing. when he when they were first phasing, the, it was the, the CGI on <laughs> Ezra's eye was, it was it was weird. Uh, otherwise, you know the yeah the cameos. Wow, the cameos of uh, Nick Cage. I can't believe they got Clooney. So I assume <laughs> that he pokes fun at himself for how bad bad. No, yeah, he Robin. does. So, yeah. So I'm sure that's why he's like, well, great. Might as well just yeah, do it one more time. But the fact is you still have to get George Clooney in your movie. <laughs> yeah. you know? And I assume they have to win after Bill. Cause I yeah. thought I saw something before the movie was released, but you know how that goes when <laughs> the rumors, of things yeah. because it, it helps promote the movie, right? And when yeah. you get even those kind I'm of just big wondering rumors. where Dean Kane and Tom Welling were for him yeah. I mean, the they TV even shows. showed they even showed Adam West a little bit. So yeah, that was good. They, saying, they like, did first Brandon Roth Yeah, they did first oh yeah, <laughs> they, yeah, they didn't do Brandon Roth. <laughs> I, I'm surprised by that because hey guys, they brought in uh, the blonde. What's oh, her name? Oh. I know she did a TV. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, the Supergirl. They left out Brandon Roth. Yeah, yeah, her. Did you make it a movie? No, we're good. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of surprised by that now that you bring that up. Uh, but otherwise, uh, the story wasn't bad at all. I, I thought mean, it's one of the better yeah, stories. And guys, again, take Ezra's personal stuff out of this. I'm judging this on a movie. I will Ron actually Levinson say... was great. I will actually say uh, Ezra did pretty good for Barry here. I, I have to assume, too, that the 18-year-old version of Barry uh, was meant to be annoying. Oh, the, for oh, sure. yeah. I think it was had because, to be because think, of the separation. I think it was because he grew up having everything versus having his parents ripped away from him. So yeah, he, he had I to mature a lot yeah, faster he, versus it looked he, like it was on easy street. Mom yeah. doing the laundry, yep. stuff like that. Yeah. The mom cleaning the place. So I think yep. they kind of... The mom the decorating laughing, the though, place. Did the, did the laughing have... Yeah, yeah, it was, he's totally it was, beef. Yeah. It was def- beef. That was definitely different. Whatever. Beefs. Yep. But uh, I, I, it how, was great to see Keats. How handsome did you think Clooney looked? Hey, oh, when, does it, when does I mean, this guy, he, this guy's he pulled out of that he car just like fine this wine. This guy's aging. But look, there's some guy like Brad Pitt. I hope Pitt I age like, like well, a couple other people. Uh, Nobody's aging like Clooney. Nobody. <laughs> well, <laughs> and I think you make a good point. Oh, sorry. No, 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 no. Go, go, I was go. just going to say, I think Dave makes a good point in that look. Um, you know, we're here to enjoy the movie, and it's unfortunate what yeah. happened in the real world. But I don't think, you know, Michael Keaton, Michael Shannon... Sasha Cali, Ron Livingston, Jeremy Irons, everybody, the writers, the directors, all the special effects people, all the people who work in marketing, the thousands of people who worked on this movie, I don't think their work should just be thrown out in the trash because of one person. I, I think that's a disservice to all the folks who work so hard in this industry and work on these films. Yeah, again, it's just it, just based on the movie, not anyone's personal uh, life here. Right. So we understand if you didn't want to watch it uh, or... I mean, you're probably not watching it if you're if you're watching us or however that goes. But totally understand your stance on it. Uh, again, we're not going to get into all that because that could be a, a whole other yeah, thing. Absolutely. We want to bring focus onto just the just movie this. and all the good components that happen with it. Well, it's just unfortunate again. It means nothing. Well, <laughs> it it, does. Uh, it well, well hey, nothing. with that being said, I think it's time we score it. <laughs> so with my, I'll yeah. start it off right. with my score. Oh, hey, hey, hey. We got you the board of truth. You know, we're here again. I'm basing this on a lot of. I'm basing this on a lot of factors, folks, because uh, there's like a Keaton scale. I know (laughs) exactly. (laughs) Because like like, you have to, you have to throw that in there. I know. So I'm gonna just kind of label it like this: with all the nostalgia factors that came into this scene, the the Nick Cages, the Clooney's, again, seeing Michael Keaton back. Uh, I'm going to give that a five. But for the film itself and where the current state of DC is, uh, I kind of got to go with this. uh, And that's high. I'm actually being generous a little bit. Uh, 3.7 is kind of where I got to go. Again, nostalgia factors of all this, five. But where we're currently at with all the DC mess and how this really meant nothing now, mm-hmm. it's a yeah, it's kind brutal. of a yeah. three point seven yeah. for me. That that, that post credit scene. Did Great job by the casting crew on this. So, 
All right, I guess I'll go next. Uh, yeah, guys, for me, um, I'm not going to necessarily split things up. I'm just going to take it as a movie uh, for what I was given. For me, it's a 4.25 out of 5 answers. Uh, as you may or may not know, I'm not the hugest comic book uh, aficionado, but I do enjoy a lot of the Marvel and DC stuff. And I thought this one was really friggin' solid. I, I really do. I Like I said, to have to deal with the multiverse timeline kind of MacGuffin that they have to work with, the way they did it and it wasn't just a cheat code i really enjoyed that well you know i do love comics and comic book movies and we watch plenty on this channel we just watched a great one the other day for this channel that you know some of us gave fives and four and a half so for the first time in a while i'm on the same wavelength as diamond dave i'm going to three seven five as well i it's it just there's just something about their movies that just it gets you to a certain point but it just can't Breakthrough. Yeah, they have like some really impactful moments. Yeah, and then there's just some head scratchers, and again, it just because like to me, to even like Man of Steel, <laughs> like they're talking about all the thousands that they that they took out, but it was that one family in the corner that finally made Superman take care of Zod. Okay, what about those buildings that all fell? But okay, that it family. Five thousand people. I'm that a little perished. rusty on uh, Man of Steel. So. <laughs> yeah, it was, uh, <laughs> look, I, I as look, we've discussed that. <laughs> I'm I'm basing my score just off of the entertainment value that I got out of this right. film. And I think Mason Quinn hit it on the head. There's so many people who put so much work into this. I mean, I, I don't know, um, uh, you know, I don't know Kiersey Clemens who played Iris um, as an actress, and I don't know what work she's done outside of this, but I have to imagine like getting a phone call and being like, hey, you're gonna be in a DC movie. Yep. It's gonna be like the highlight of your acting career, you know, and some to of these people point. who had, you know, uh, you know, smaller roles, getting the chance to, to be on set and do this stuff with DC, and look, I get it. Like when a main character is out there doing whatever, you know, that that sours, you know, people's opinions for the movie as a whole. But think about just the hours and the heart and the soul that went into this for so many people. And then one person who you have zero control over, that shouldn't take away from that. So I'll say that. Oh, that's that's my piece on that. I just wanted to recognize that I thought Mason Quinn's example was really good about how many people put so much work into this. Um, I, look, I thought it was a really fun movie. Is it the best comic book movie I've ever seen? No, but it was very, very enjoyable for me. And I'm going to say, look, nostalgia factor is part of the movie. Uh, and I get why, why Dave separates it. He's a little bit more analytical. He's a little bit more into the comic stuff. But look, it, that makes a movie better for me. If you have a good story, and I'm going to give it this score, and you have the same story, but you throw in a shit ton of nostalgia factor, I'm giving it a better score. I'm hey, going sorry, 4.5 on this one. The fact that they had Keaton, Christopher Reeve, Clooney at the end, we're like, who, we're all, whose voice is that? Whose voice is that? I thought it was a good story with a lot of fun action. The nostalgia factor, 4.5 for me. Uh, Jeez, that's only 0.5 off of Shawshank, and then you'll probably never watch this again. Yeah, but the, the <laughs> but it's a graduate it's a graduated it's, scale. Like yeah. to get to a four to a four five over here. To get from a four <laughs> to a four five, that's one thing. Yeah, to get from a four five to a four seven five, that's hard. To get from a four seven five to a five, so it's yeah. not it's not the same. It's you not know, the, the same. The hey, one thing I wished. Went, sorry, uh, no, sorry, you go, real you quick. Go. That you're forgetting though, Andrew. His this is part of Back to the Future, yeah. which is his. You know, yeah, a lot of Back, back to the Future the references. To the the, yep. the fact that they used a bolt of lightning, <laughs> I'm like, and I don't know if it's going to make the for cut. A Biff Tanner to grab this the ball. This is and the clock it. tower. I, I I was honestly waiting. It's funny that you mentioned that because I was like, are we going to get a Biff Tanner reference or something? <laughs> yeah, I mean, come on, they look this. Eric Stoltz. Yeah. Eric Stoltz. He's got hey, the tie too. It's yeah. upside down. <laughs> what about now? The, the only thing that I, the only oh. thing that I was with wishing for was I was really hoping in in Wayne Manor that they would have a picture of the old Alfred from 1989, oh, 1992. Yeah. I wish we would have had a been picture a of job. that actor. Awesome. That would have been great. Been great. But <sighs> that was the only thing I thought. It, that I that would have no liked. Robin, no. Yeah, I'm, sure, look, I'm sure there's probably, if you watch this back, they should have I'm, Marlon there's got to be more Easter Remember, eggs. he was going to be oh, in forever. Of, I guarantee there's more Easter, Easter eggs. eggs. Yeah. And I'm sure if we Google it, there's a lot. If only. So, that was still a fun ride that we had, and it was really fast. So for Diamond Dave, Evelyn Hope, Mason Quinn, I'm, of course, the answer. Good night, pals.